Hi, beautiful. <laughs> I look like I'm straight out of a 80s slash 90s hip hop music video. I don't know how to feel about that. I think that's a good thing. I think we're gonna embrace it today. Uh, <laughs> I don't know, man, I'm losing my mind. Well, I mean, my mind was already lost, but losing it further, I guess. I'll be watching two different people go from having extremely, extremely long dreadlocks past their butt to no dreads anymore. And from the thumbnails, they look like very dramatic transformations. You guys know I love a good dreadlock removal video. They excite me. It's so fun to watch. It relieves all my stress, which I need today. So let's watch these videos together and check out these unbelievable transformations. Let's do it. Up first, we have a video by Summer Daydreams, and this is called Combing Out My Dreads After Six Years. New year, new me. And this has a whopping two million views, so pff, I feel like it's gonna be good. I'm really feeling this. Okay, friends, so. Hi, friend. Whoa, those dreadlocks. Sorry, we pretty much didn't even begin watching the video yet, but I already have something to say because I talk too much. Her dreads are so long and so thick. She must have been growing those out for years, years and years, like six years. Like, holy shit, she's about to make such a big change in her life. I'm so excited for it. <laughs> I'm ready for change. It is time. I'm ready to comb out my dreads. Oh! We're so ready for it. We're so ready for it. So I'm actually gonna be starting the process. Oh my, hold up. I thought they were long before she picked them up. Now that she picked them up, what in the world? Oh my God, 10 years of growth. That must be 10 years of dreadlocks. I have had them for six years. Six years, my first guess was right. Beautiful six years it has been. And uh, um, they are like down to my butt. Oh. Uh. Ultimately, I do not want to buzz my head and I think I'm just really ready for this. This is a bittersweet time for me. I am nervous because I'm afraid that I'm going to regret this decision. That's so scary. Cut them first and that way I can comb out from here up. Trying to comb out all of this would take probably a month. I had long hair already before I dreaded my hair. It was already down. I'm sorry, I can't believe what's going on right now. My bum. And then of course when I dreaded it, you lose length. It was about shoulder length. The dreads are just too heavy. I don't really necessarily like the bulky weight. Um, It's gonna be definitely a process. It's gonna take me probably a week. Oh my God, no. I have no idea. Thank you. 44 dreads total. I'm gonna just be coming them out with a metal comb. Oh my God, I'm so happy she has help with this. I'm excited excited for this big initial chop. I mean, they're gonna need like shrub cutting shears for these. Like these things are really thick. You like break your scissors with them. He's just going in with some regular scissors here. Dude, ah, oh, I am so excited. I just love watching like dead ends fall to the floor. These are definitely some dead ends. Oh my God, that is so much hair, dude. Whoa. What? What? It's a honeycomb of mold. Hey, just looking at all that. What? Was mold. Ah, she's like, oh my god, <laughs> that really? makes you feel better. Of course. Out, it? Are you sure that's not just fuzzy balls? No, 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 no that's mold. Are you sure? That's moisture buildup. Oh my god, I didn't even know that was a thing where you could just grow mold in your dreads. That makes a lot of sense, but I never really thought about it. Also, that could be such a health hazard for her. So I'm very happy she's getting rid of them. They probably take so long to dry, like he said. Her hair's so long. I mean, you have to probably sit in the sun and wait for them to dry for an entire day if you're washing your dreads. Oof, that's scary. I thought they smelled funny. Oh, is it more again? Yeah. Where? In the very oh, center. So oh, ew, gross. Oh my god. Oh, no. Weird. That's mold and dandruff gathered together. No, thank you. And now he's going to work with the comb, the metal comb, and he's gonna completely comb them out like he's doing. Whoa, he did a great job. Oh my God. They're just gonna have to sit there forever. She said it might take an entire week. All right, y'all, so I am at the salon and Christy, hi. My best friend here is coming Christy, you're out. doing God's work, baby. She has conditioner all up in there and she is combing away. No, no, thank you. I mean, she has beautiful hair. I am happy they're not shaving it off. I mean, it's just gonna take a really long time, but oh my God, they have barely made any progress. 30 more to go. She said she has 30 more to go. 
I'm gonna try to knock them out this weekend. It means I have a lot coming out so between today, Saturday, and tomorrow, Sunday. No! It's gonna go a lot faster if I soak my dreads in detangler. So she is soaking her hair in this cowboy magic stuff, I guess what it's called. And it's supposed to help uh, her dreadlocks untangle. Good for her with these patience, girl, because I would have shaved my head already. I would have given up. But she is determined. She's going through it and she's doing it. And wow, that's actually looking really good. And I feel like her hair is just going to be so luscious and pretty when she's all done. Uh, so we got six combed out tonight. So I have 11 left to go. You're kidding. 11. The remaining 11 tomorrow. And I can't believe it. Slowly but surely, it is happening. Oh my god, T6. So this is hopefully the final session. I have 11 dreads left. They're so close to the finish line, dude. So I want to weigh all of the hair that I cut off and combed out. Oh my god, I'm sorry. I keep on going. This is honestly just so shocking to me. That's one pound of hair she just took off. Okay, y'all, so it's the moment that I have been- Oh my God! That is- We made it! Brushing- We made it to the finish line! I have not brushed my hair. <laughs> she looks so cute. Okay, so let me just show you like all of my hair. Oh my God, and her hair is still somehow so thick. Very thin. I don't she said it was very thin. Thick, wavy hair. Since I combed out the, the dreads, like I lost a lot of hair. Some of the hair just kind of ripped out. Whoa. I shedded a lot of hair too. The first. Wow. So here we go. Wow. Oh, this is so satisfying. Oh, I bet. Oh, Holy. That's the one thing that I am most excited about now is being able to brush my scalp. That's pretty much it. That is my fluff. Yes. Hair. It's such a weird You need a haircut now. A good like haircut would be good. Feather, it's just like wisp. I'm glad that I was able to salvage as much hair as I did because some people, their dreads are so mature and matted that they have to just buzz their head. I will show you my haircut now. Oh, yay, she's getting a haircut. I thought she was going to end the video there, but we're getting a haircut. Please do it short. Please do it short. Oh, my God, it looks so much better. Oh my God, Summer, that was a lot. Just watching that, it gave me a slight amount of stress, but also pleasure, but mostly stress. I mean, I can't believe you spent over a week doing this process. Good for you, girl. I don't know if I would have made it. You look amazing and congratulations on your new dread-free life. Let's move on to the next video. And our next video is by Justin and Juby. And this is cutting my dreadlocks off after nine years. Amazing transformation. Let's check it out. Today, I purchased something. What'd you get? Actively take action on this thought. Oh, she's gonna shave off the dreads. Who's going to trim her beard? I've been thinking that I wanted to get rid of my locks, but I hadn't actually thought that it was gonna overwhelm my We're doing mind. it today. Quickly and I can't wait to see it. A lot has happened in nine years of having dreadlocks. Nine years? Dude, that's a long time something and i need to do something about it Whoa. i'm gonna just do the back underneath see how it goes oh continue maybe next week okay i'm scared but excited it's like <laughs> i don't want to regret me too decision and i also want and it's not even my hair i'm happy to be oh. making this decision because it's like nine years i haven't cut my hair actually it's more like oh. 10, 12 years i'm just done with this look i'm done with the locks i'm done with growing roots and i'm ready to kind of like start fresh and like have a different hairdo and feel lighter uh, i'm yeah i love that for you I'm sitting on my hair man i'm tired of shutting my hair out the corridor this is a huge deal could you imagine having your hair the same like that for 10 years and then you're gonna just shave it all off <gasps> whoa sorry i was having a vision we're going for it it's the first shave First one down, baby. Bye. Didn't miss ya. Won't miss ya. That's so crazy. It's like as long. That's insane. Yeah, I can film on her head. That's insane. Now the husband is going in and shaving it all off. Well, you're at on accident chopping things you shouldn't be chopping. That's true. We're doing an undercut at first, I guess. Yeah, I'll finesse it when I get close. That's still super duper long. Going down the five. Ah, Justin! You gotta quit moving. I you didn't move! Moving your hand. I didn't move! Just stop moving your head and your hand in my way. Take a picture. Oh, a little ratchet. 
a little ratchet. So now phase two, a couple weeks later, she's going a little bit higher now, cutting off the dreads. She's making her way up. Oh my God, I can't wait to see what she's gonna look like with like a bald head. I feel like she's gonna look just as pretty or even better. Also, who is your, why is your boyfriend or husband or whatever so hot? And look, it doesn't even look. Ooh, she looks so cute. I love this undercut though. It's a moment. Just to bring you up to date, she decided that she didn't want to keep this undercut for as long as she thought she was going to keep it for. She actually just wants to go and shave it all off. And she's reminiscing on the past. And so that is where we're at. I want to say I know I'm ready for it, but I'm scared. So there's like a little fear in me that's like making me think rather than know. It's gonna be amazing, babe. It's gonna look amazing. I don't want another one of those nasty vodka shots, though. So I had curly hair. I always, I guess I still do have curly hair. Uh, Ooh, she has curly hair. I can't wait to see that. Time. The longer I would grow it, the shorter it would get because the more curly it would get. Oh my god, look how long her hair is. She's about to get rid of all this length. That is so huge. Oh my god. This is the moment we've been waiting for. It's finally coming. She's gonna do it all. She's gonna get rid of it all. The front ones are going. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Yes. I know, seeing it like not on my body is like weird. She, she's like, what the hell am I doing? Why am I doing this? What do I do? Do I go back? Do I keep going? Doing great, though. I'm just happy she's not trying to brush them out. <laughs> Too much work, man. That must weigh five pounds, all that hair. It has to. <laughs> you can't just keep that. Oh, the last few pieces. Cut them, baby, cut them. Oh my gosh, she's so pretty. I'm hypnotized by what's going on right now. It's so much fun to watch. Okay, that just happened. Holy crap, yeah, it did. <laughs> Just leave that one oh as a souvenir. I like it. I feel like a totally different person. Do I? Yeah. In a good way? Yeah, in a great way. Should I keep this one? <laughs> yes, please keep that one. I can't believe that was on your head. My head's like so small. I look so different. She looks younger, a lot younger. God, that's great. <laughs> Give that a good wash a good trim and it's gonna look great. We are now shaving it all off, thank God. I thought they were gonna leave it like that for a second. We're doing the full thing, we're shaving it. And she is keeping that one dread, I think, which I'm kind of excited about. I feel like once you wash your hair, you'll figure out what you want. I mean, you can always go shorter, like wash it first and then decide. Oh my God. I can't tell if she's happy or like totally sad. Oh, gross. <laughs> it's like flinging across the room, look. Oh my God, she's so pretty. See what this decade holds. I'm into it. I'm so into it. And I'm using my hair serum and it feels really good on my- We did it. I didn't do anything, but you did it. Starting or ending, it's an exciting period of your life. It will change you and take you on a journey. I saw other people cut their dreads. I was always like, no. Obviously I knew what they were going through this like liberating feeling of needing to be a new person and cut their hair off. You just get so accustomed to seeing someone look a certain way that you're kind of not really ready to see them any other way. Yeah. Life changes and people change and hair grows back. That's such a good message. I love that. Enjoyed the end of my dreadlock journey. She's just such a beautiful person. You can tell, like, I just want to be friends with her and her just tell me nice things all day. <laughs> I don't know. She just seems so happy and oh my God. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Love it. Congratulations. So sickening. Ah, I'm obsessed. The journey was beautiful. Thank you for sharing that video with us. Dude, oh my God. Those were incredible. I mean, they gave me everything I wanted. They were even better than I thought they were going to be. Both really great transformations in two different ways. One girl, you know, ended up brushing out her hair and getting a haircut. That was really cool. And another girl ended up shaving it. That was super cool to watch. Thank you both for sharing those videos with the world. They were so fun to watch. And that is all for today, guys. Make sure you follow me on all the different social media networks, including TikTok, Twitter, and Instagram at NYC. Also, make sure you check out my Facebook page and my Snapchat show under Bradmondo. And of course, if you want beautiful, fabulous, amazing, Amazing glowing hair. Check out Xmondo Hair at xmondohair.com or check us out on Instagram at Xmondo Hair. That's all for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to live your extra life, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys. This is Hydromania, our conditioning mist. Hydromania is for those of you looking for hydrated, silky, soft, shiny hair, which I think is all of you. This is guaranteed to make your hair way more manageable, detangled, smooth, and just all around fabulous.